here it is, the long-awaited sequel to I'm, I'm never playing Five Nights at Freddy's in VR ever again. I, I f***ing played it in VR again, you know. I said at the end of the video, if it ever got like 50 likes or something, I'll play it again. And uh, you guys smashed that goal, got 88 likes. Um, one person didn't like it though, however, I don't know why. I do have a heart rate monitor. It doesn't work because it's made by like some shitty Chinese brand, Polar or something. Uh, which is a shame because I actually think I would have probably hit the 200 BPM. Yeah, if you like this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to your here and turn on post notifications. If this gets another 50 likes, I'll make a part three. But I really doubt it because it's been like four months. Nobody's going to be waiting to watch it. <laughs> what was the f- What was that? Okay, we're continuing because I heard a vent and this isn't among us. I promised my girlfriend I'd do vent repair when I next played this, so I have to do vent repair. But I really don't want to do vent repair. That's the thing. Welcome to vent repair. Fazbear Entertainment prides itself on having the most comfortable facilities. Each facility is set to a perfect 72 degrees all the time. I know what that is in normal. The indicator lights mean we have a well-functioning ventilation system. Your headlamp should protect you from any critters who may have stumbled into the ducts. As a certified vent technician, you should need no instruction. However, in case of an emergency, it is important to remember that as the vent technician, you should never, under any circumstances, attempt to... <laughs> Oh, fuck this! Oh. <sighs> okay, we're not doing vent repair. No, we're not. <sighs> Could you imagine playing this with a Quest 1? With OLED? Could you imagine that? Imagine the blacks being black. Like, for me, if you're watching this on an OLED device, imagine that being real life. Yeah, we'll play FNAF 2. Uh, hello? Hello, hello? Hello. Uh, hello and welcome to your new summer job at the new and improved Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Is it infinite uh, power in this one? talk you through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here and to help you get started down this new and exciting career path. Uh, now, I want you to forget anything you may have heard about the old location. Uh, some people, you may have noticed there are no doors for you to close. <laughs> uh, but hey, you have a life, and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. So don't worry about the place going dark. Well, I think that's it. Uh, you should be golden. Uh, check the lights, put on the spray ahead if you need to. Uh, keep the music box wound up. Piece of cake. Have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Guys, I'm not a fan of Five Nights at Freddy's VR. I actually forgot how much I hate this game. Lord have mercy on my soul. I haven't sinned that much in my life. <laughs> hey, I've never killed anyone. That you know of. I don't like Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh. Oh. Oh, we did it. Bro, are you gonna do something? Do something. <gasps> that fucker moved. <laughs> what happens if the time runs out? What happens if the time runs out? What happens if the time runs out? <laughs> ah!
Are you having fun yet? That's great to hear. No. I am not. I showed a friend this as their like first experience kind of in VR. I'm sorry. If you're watching this, Ash, I'm really sorry. <laughs> Forgot how fucking scary this was. Let's try FNAF 3. Right now the plate is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky crop. Uh, oh. I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, we don't have something really cool by next week, so we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, oh. <laughs> Uh, but, you so know, nothing like can kill me this this night. So this is just a tutorial. I'm basically just to look around and see things, make sure nothing fucks up and stuff like that. I should get this one ready because that one hasn't failed yet. So all right. So I guess we'll just we do went night. To great lengths to create an authentic VR experience. Including okay. using scanned photographs for reference and using original performance routines where applicable. Huh. Hey man, okay, I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are like prehistoric. I think they were like training tapes for like other employees or something like that. So I thought we could like have them playing like over the speakers as people walk through the attraction. Dude, that makes this feel legit, oh, man. this one. But I have an even better surprise. For That's you. really close. You're not gonna believe this. We found one, a real one. Uh, uh, uh gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's in there somewhere. I'm, I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Uh, sure, bro. Uh, hello. What the fuck are you? <laughs> Wait. That's him. No. <sighs> Get out of my office. Why are you still here? I'm gonna look away and count to, to five, and then- Oh my god! I hate this. This sucks.